Hey, what's going on everybody? Isaac Okuson here with Civil Engineering Academy. Today I'm going to share with you a couple quick tips. This is a topic that we're talking about today is the top five areas that civil engineers specialize in. Alright, so let's dive right into it. There are five different areas that civil engineers really dive into. The first one is water resources and environmental. Those are two categories kind of combined into one. So these two uh, categories deal with anything and everything to do with water, water quality, you know, reservoirs, piping. They also deal with all of the environmental effects due to, let's say, a tank that is at a gas station that's leaking. Uh, they have to figure out how that water is flowing, so groundwater. Uh, anything and everything to do with water or environmental concerns falls under that category. So that's number one. The second one is geotechnical engineers. Geotechnical engineers like to deal with soils and anything and everything to do with soils. This deals with uh, groundwater hydrology as well. It could deal with building dams because a lot of dams are earth dams. But anything to deal with what's in the soil itself, and that includes foundations for buildings, anything like that. So a geotechnical engineer deals with dirt. And the next one is a structural engineer. And just as the name says, they deal with structures. So buildings, bridges, uh, all your sky rise stuff. Uh, any bridge that you see, they approve home plans as well. So anywhere you have a structural structure, you need to be a structural engineer. Uh, a lot of times structural engineers are professional engineers, but they do additional testing, so they become an SE, which is called a structural professional structural engineer. So we've got three nailed out there. The next one is going to be a transportation engineer. A transportation engineer deals with traffic, traffic studies. They work for all your local state agencies or contractors, but they determine um, basically, you know, traffic volumes. And as population grows, they have to determine, um, you know, what to do with the roads. So they design roadways. Um, anything to do with roads, highways, uh, traffic signaling. A lot of statistics are involved with those type of models as well. So anything to do with that is a transportation engineer, which is a part of civil engineering. And the last one, last category that civil engineers fall into is construction engineers. And this is kind of a very broad um, field of study. Uh, construction engineers typically go into a project management type of area um, where they are managing projects, overseeing it, and make sh making sure things that are built fall under budget uh, within schedule and within the scope of the project. So those are the five different areas that civil engineers end up kind of going to and choosing which area they want to specialize in. Um, I, we always recommend that you do specialize in an area because that's going to make you the most profitable as a civil engineer as you specialized in a, in a particular area and carry that with you your entire career. So anyway, that's the top five areas. Um, Please subscribe and check us out. Also head to civilengineeringacademy.com if you'd like to learn more about becoming a professional engineer, career advice, or even studying for your FE exam, which you have to do, have to pass in order to even graduate from school. So lots of great resources there. Check it out. Anyway, we will catch you on the next one. See ya.